In this video we'll be making use of the lattice graphics package in R to create scatter plots. To illustrate creating a scatter plot we'll be looking at data on the UK population between the years 1992 and 2009. So we'll create this data frame ourselves and save it as an object uk.df. So we make use of the data.frame function. So the year is specified with 1992 colon 2009, where colon creates a sequence of numbers between those two, incrementing by one, so by each year. And then a column of populations, which we've stored in terms of thousands of people. So we'll just print out the data that we've saved so we can see that it's been input as we'd expect it to. So we first of all load in the lattice package using the require function so that we have access to the functions that we want to use to create this particular plot. First up what we're going to do is we're going to change some of the way that the symbols appear. So the way we do that is to make use of the themes and themes is, takes off the trellis um, plotting parameters. So the first thing that we do is we want to create our own theme. So we make use of the trellis.par.get function to extract the current setting of trellis parameters. So the thing that we're interested in changing is the symbols that are used in the superpose symbol section. So this is appropriate for where you might have multiple groups and you'd want to have potentially different colors or different plot symbols corresponding to each of the group. So what we're doing here is repeating the number 16 seven times because the plot symbol that we're interested in is number 16. Number 16 is a solid circle. So what we will also do is for this particular example, as we won't be using groups, we'll change the plot dot symbol rather than the superpose symbol just to ensure that the particular symbol that we get is the right one. So then what we need to do is to actually set this particular theme and we use the trellis.par.set function to set a new series of parameters. And we make use of this theme, tmp.theme, which we created with those uh, change settings. So now what we want to do is to make use of the function xyplot. xyplot is used to create scatter plots in the lattice graphics. So first up is a formula and this is population tilde year. So here we're plotting the population on the y-axis and the x-axis has the year where the data was recorded. We then specify the data frame where the data is stored with the data argument. Xlab and Ylab are texts that appear on the X and Y axes respectively. And then main is the title for the whole graph, which here is UK population from 1992 to 2009. The last thing that we've changed here is the scales argument. The scales argument allows us to change the way, for example, the tick marks appear and so on on the x-axis. So what we're asking for here is to have a sequence from 1992 to 2009 and our plot is going to show the years with every two years as that's what the sequence is doing. So it can be 1992, 1994 and so on.